Good morning, everybody. It is my intention. It is 8.10 in the morning on Tuesday. I do not work on Tuesdays. So that is my day to get a bunch of errands done. But I've been so MIA this year. What is going on with me? I have no idea why I have felt the need to go MIA, but I have. And it's not like my life is getting, I mean, obviously last August when I went back to work, my life got not as interesting because I'm spending majority of the time, a big chunk of time away from the camera. But we are here, it's Tuesday, errand day. I have a whole bunch of errands. Actually, I have an entire list of things that we need to do. Also, I dyed my hair darker. I uh, am getting used to it. It's gonna fade a ton because my hair, honestly, I think my soul wants to be blonde. My hair wants to be blonde and it just doesn't. That's all it knows, so yeah. Uh, we need to do a bunch of things today. UPS, gotta return a swimsuit. They sent me the tops and not the bottoms, but then they replaced it, Amazon got love them, Replace it the next day with both the tops and the bottom. Super cute bathing suit, but I need to go to UPS so they can scan my barcode and then have that returned. I need to go to the post office because I need to send in my car payment for this car. I need to drop off a check to the neighbors to get the pond treated. I need to go to grocery pickup. I probably should do that first. And then I need to go to Walgreens to get eyelashes and nails. I am gonna get my nails done, I think next Thursday. I'm gonna redeem myself in our friendship. I'm gonna take you guys to the Bahamas with us, but I have to do a lot of prep work in order to get my family to the Bahamas. So we need to like pack, double check, check things off our list, do all of that stuff. But I think you guys are gonna have a good time with me. I also need to go to the bank. I need to get money out of the ATM, which is my account. I need to deposit a check into mine and Cody's joint account. And then I may stop at the pet store to get cat food. And I may stop at the Dollar Tree. We're gonna just see how much stuff we can get checked off this list and be back to, I would like to straighten up and clean up the house. I am hoping that this vlog ends up on the internet. You guys, I've vlogged probably 50 times and they're just sitting on my SD cards. I'm not putting them on the internet and I don't know why. I don't know why, but um, we're not putting them up. I think it's laziness more than anything. Laziness. Okay, let's go. Let's if we drop the check off to the neighbors, we can check that off. And then we will go to the grocery pickup. And maybe the bank. We'll see what time it is. We just picked them up. We dropped the check off to my neighbors. And then I Googled everything and I realized a couple things about my plan of attack for my errands this morning. Is that nothing's open until 9. It's 8.30. So what I'm going to do... I also, like a light bulb went off and I remembered I've got to print some pictures. I bought a photo printer, but I can't find the SD card that the pictures are on. I mean, I have a ton of SD cards laying around. So I need to go home and get them off of my computer because I feel like it's easier to do Walgreens photo printing from an actual computer, not a phone. So we're gonna do that. Hopefully get them printed in the hour, go out, drop our groceries off, and then go out and conquer everything. And hopefully by the time I'm putting groceries away and adding the pictures, it's 9 o'clock anyways and everywhere is open. But I would like to be home by at least 10, 30, 11 o'clock if I can. If I can. Because I would like to finish putting away laundry that's in my basement and just straighten up everything. Vacuum, make beds do all of that. Wipe down bathroom sinks, all the fun things that, you know, moms have to do. I do, I am on a search. I do want to try a cleaning service, maybe like right before I leave for vacation, if I could find somebody to do that. Oh, 
only because that takes a whole nother level of stress because I always like to have my house perfect for when um, for when somebody's staying in my house to watch my pets. So we have Lindsay staying this time. She's the one that watched, if you guys watched my Alaska vlogs, watched Blue while and my other pets while I was uh, on the school bus while I was on the Alaska cruise and she did a great job. So I want my house to be nice and clean for that. I don't know, I may look it up. Maybe I'll like see if somebody can, I don't know, twice. I would like to maybe like have it this Thursday. But we'll see. See, it's a dreary rainy day outside today. Oh. Are you guys bobbing? Is my hand moving? I feel like it's moving. I need my little stick back. Skylar stuck it on her camera. I have no idea where that's at. I need to get it back so it stabilizes you all a little bit better. All right, let's go home and I'll show you what groceries I got. So I tried to organize this the best that I could. I can tell you that for dinners this week, we are having fajitas tonight i'm gonna go ahead and put the fajita meat in a crock pot and just set it on low and that can cook for a few hours i'm trying to think if i want to do that now or wait until a little bit i think i'm gonna go ahead and do it now um, and then we can just pick at it i'm catholic tomorrow's ash wednesday for us and that means that tomorrow we don't eat meat and we don't eat meat on fridays so we are having fish tomorrow chicken and dumplings on thursday and then friday we usually go out to eat or pick something up we'll probably have cheese pizza if i had to guess but that is what this stuff kind of correlates to that and lunches we'll start up here i am also side note going to make a skinny cheeseburger casserole for my lunches this week i am on as i told you let's you know get ready for a cruise diet so we are going to make that. These are on sale for a dollar, so I picked up two. I also picked up some lean ground beef. I do this and this, diced tomatoes, cheese, uh, mustard, ketchup, and pickles. And mix it up. Really good. My friend Tiffany told me about it. I made it, and I'm kind of craving it. Fajitas is what's for dinner tonight. I've got this fajita mix. Peppers that are already, and onions already cut up. I'll probably heat this up in the crock pot, like I told you, and then throw that in last minute. We heat a seasoning mix. I like to put it over top of everything. And then some flour tortillas. I already have cheese, already have sour cream in the fridge. Some baby carrots. I've been sticking these in little baggies with a little um, ranch sauce cup in my kids' lunches, so I picked some of those up. Some jumbo biscuits for chicken and dumplings. Two of these apple walnut salads some string cheese, two cans of diced tomatoes, two cans of cream of chicken, some grapes, two things of strawberries, unsweet coconut milk, because I love these two things together, some 2% reduced fat milk, some chocolate checks. These are ginormous. Look at how big this cutie is. I picked up a box of these and some and five bananas. Some frozen peas and carrots, some broccoli and cheese sauce. Jet loves this. Double stuff Oreos, some tartar sauce, chicken broth, white chocolate mocha coffee creamer, Tim Hortons coffee, some onion rings, this rotini alfredo, very good, it's vegetable pasta and rotini marinara, some little cheeseburgers, some Uncrustables, toaster strudels, super sweet corn, tortilla chips, fruit by the foot, Two different types of these granola bars. One's dipped, one's not dipped. Some Honest Kids apple juice. I found one of these in my glove box and I drank it yesterday and it was really good. So I picked up a pack of those. When I say I picked up, I mean they threw it in my car. They picked up and then I picked it up and brought it here. Anyway, some chips. Blue loves this dog food. I know you're like, Erica, for a great day in that last you like a day. 
but they didn't have any of the really big ones. So I'm gonna have to probably order that online. But he loves this food and I think you can only get it at Kroger because I think this is a Kroger brand. And he also loves these snacks and he is super, super picky about both. Paper towels, love these guys. They are cheap. I think it's $5.99 for these six. However, they leave a lot of paper towel dust. So that is my only complaint, but I'll deal with the dust because I like the price. Method glass and surface cleaner, and then my laundry detergent. And this smells so good. It's clean meadow scent. And that is everything that I got. Right, Harley? Oh, you know what? I have to say this. So I am always wondering about people's pets. My pets are doing really well. Harley is still alive. Blue. You're still here? Yes. You look so little on that couch. A lot of comments that I get from people that have seen Blue not in person is they're like, wow, he's a lot bigger than, than I thought he was. I get that all the time. So the camera must slim you. you must You must be slim. And then, the, and then the bunny is doing well too. So we gotta clean out your cage bun. That is on my list of things to do today. But I wanted to show you guys my groceries first. Now I'm gonna put this away, quickly upload those pictures and then hopefully be out of here. I said nine, but it's 8.50 now. Hopefully by like 9.15. We are gonna set this on low for eight hours. It's just a fajita meat. I also just sprinkled it with just a little bit of seasoning mix. So we'll let that cook. I sent my pictures. Let me turn you around, hold on. I sent my pictures to Walgreens. However, they said that they couldn't print them. They, meaning the internet, like their webpage, told me to pick them up anytime after 12.55. But I have found with Walgreens, sometimes their time frame that they tell you, they get done quicker. It's only 35 pictures and the pictures are from the father-daughter dance. There were quite a few that I don't think got their pictures. So I'm gonna try to sort them out and get them to the appropriate families and get them off of the, not off of like the album will still always be there, but get that completely done so we can check that off of our list. I am a little bit behind schedule. It is 9.30 and we're gonna leave. We're gonna go run the rest of our errands and then come back here, hopefully clean up a little bit and just kind of get it, you know, get organized, get it together is what we're gonna try to do. Because I feel like the days where I get it all done, even if I don't feel like getting it done, are my best days. Let's go. We are now at the bank. I am gonna go inside and ask this question. I needed to A, make a deposit, B, get money out of the ATM, and this is the bank that I bank at, but I also have a car loan that I need to mail, but I'm wondering if they would take it. So I'm gonna go inside, make my deposit, see what they say, or if they could even like set me up on automatic payments, that would be great. And then we'll go through the ATM. I decided, because this is the furthest out of the circle that I'm driving in. We're going to start here and make our way in a big circle till we get back home. I feel like that's the the smartest move for me to make. So I'm going to go inside and talk to them for a minute and I will be right back out. Note to self, can drop off my payments here. So that got taken care of so we don't have to go to the post office, which I love when I get to mark something off because the post office was the furthest the other direction so don't have to do that i was gonna have her put me in automatic payments but since the car is in cody's name he has to sign saying that it's okay to pay for it even though it's out of our joint account and both of our names are on it but i told him that's fine because he is here he comes here to bank i think not real often but kind of often so we're gonna go to the atm and then the next place that is on our stops is Dollar Tree. It is Iowa testing for Sienna and I'm gonna pick her up some gum and I'm gonna look at their Easter decorations because I'm really getting, I'm getting the, the itch to put it all out. I don't really celebrate 
St. Patrick's Day. We're not Irish, we're Norwegian and German. Or, yeah, Norwegian and German and something else. Czechoslovakian, I think. I don't even know. My mom did the ancestry thing, but we are not Irish. Not even like a 1% of that. So we don't really celebrate that. So it's not like I'm decorating for St. Patrick's Day. Cause I'm not. But it's Fat Tuesday before. I have to decide what I'm going to give up for Lent because I have no idea. We're in the ATM drive-thru. I always feel like I'm gonna hit something. One of these days, I probably will. Do you hear my car telling me I'm too close? So, anyway, we're gonna get a Dollar Tree. It was on my list. I gotta pay attention. Dollar Tree, oh, Walgreens, they emailed me and told me that my photos are already ready. So the 12.55 thing, I told you guys, they always do that. I... I'm going to stop there also. Dollar Tree, Walgreens, Bank, and UPS. It's yelling at me to take my card. Well, I know. I feel like I had somewhere really important to go today. just UPS and Walgreens are those my important stops I guess so let's go to Dollar Tree and I will pick up a couple things and I'll show you in the car what what I got this vlog is gonna turn into the stuff Erica buys I just got out of Dollar Tree very successful trip I'll show you a lot of random a lot of random things but I got each one of my kids these little squishies I thought that they were cute. So we're gonna put these actually in here. That's it. I got, the reason that I went in there was because it's Iowa Jackson and Sienna needed mints and gum because they let them chew gum and eat mints while they're taking the test to wake them up. So I got those two things for her. These packets of Excedrin and Tylenol. So where I work, the building next door we like to put little things in a little basket however these might end up going into the vending machine i'm not really sure what she would do but i felt like these were just in the bathroom for anybody to take so i felt like they needed to be replenished because everybody took them i also got these cute little hair things that have a little a little i thought that's so cute especially like when we go on vacation and they want to put their hair up and put two little buns they can do that look cute put this back in here i'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible this is a bag i think of all of the St. Patrick's Day stuff. So I don't know if they're going to be able to dress for St. Patrick's Day. Some years they do, some years they don't. Or do have they always? I have no idea. But I bought Sienna a little flower crown. I bought Jet this because he has to make a leprechaun trap. So I thought I would get like a few little things for him. And then I got Skylar this little bow and then two four by six picture frames for my desk at home. This other one this is for Jet's leprechaun trap. I don't know exactly how he wants to decorate it. I'll try to find most of the stuff for my house but we've got that. Antibacterial soft soap hand soap. I really like this kind. It's in a set crisp clean and I like it little hair clippy things. I needed some so I got mine in black but these are for the girls. Mechanical pencils for Sienna. Uh, actually we need them at home. But I thought how fun and spring like are these puppies so I picked those up and then the last bag of things that I got. I have this hanging on my fireplace. I got one for my friend Tiffany because I feel like these are going to go really really quickly so I have that one 
but I also get this one for my basement. I'm gonna hang it below my TV. So, got two of those. This cute little happy Easter decor. I thought he was just precious, so we picked him up. And then for my front porch, I got this little sign. I think I'm just gonna set it like in front of the little tree that I already have on there. And then I got this sign. It says, Bunny, please stop here. So that is everything that I got. I thought it was a pretty successful trip. Hopefully I didn't say God 85 different times. Because you guys, I've been watching these people who say, um, and I find that I count them like a psychopath. Like this person said, um, eight times in the first two minutes. I probably do too. I probably say a lot of filler words. I hope that I don't annoy you guys like other people annoy my soul. We're gonna go. We're gonna go to Walgreens. Let's go. It is 11 or 7. We got out of Walgreens. I'm driving home now and I picked up the pictures and then eyelashes and these really good nails that Kiss makes. They're nude acrylic and they last like a really long time. I'm gonna put those on and I'm gonna see how many days they last because if they last more than four, which last time they lasted about a week, if they last more than four, I may do that for my cruise. Instead of going to get my nails done just because it is so bad for my nails like my my nails just don't recover after getting acrylic ones put on so I picked those up and then I picked up some pictures and two lips new lipsticks which is exciting it was buy one get one half off so I picked up two of them and then we went to the UPS store did that return which was great and now we're on our way home I think I said earlier that I wanted to be home by 11 11 and 9 now so I'm doing actually pretty good considering the amount of errands that we just ran together we went to a lot of different stores I'm trying to think if I need to go anywhere else I'm like trying to plan ahead for like the weekend and stuff I don't think I do I think we're good and then I can go home and clean and maybe sit on YouTube. I'm gonna make that cheeseburger, the skinny cheeseburger casserole because I am starving. I'm so hungry. And then I'm gonna dish it out and meal prep that way. So I'll see you guys when I get back home. I just turned on my oven. It is 11.23. We are going to quickly make this skinny cheeseburger casserole. I'm gonna use the veggie rotini pasta. I'm gonna do the entire box, and then once that is done, I'm gonna take it out and drain it, put in some diced tomatoes, a couple squirts of ketchup, a couple squirts of mustard, and then I'm going to crumble up a pound of lean ground beef, add that to it with some pickles, and then top it with some cheese, and then put it in the oven for like 15 minutes but I'm starving. This is gonna be my lunch, so I'm excited to get it going. So I have the vegetable noodles, a can of diced tomatoes, and then the crumbled ground beef. It's a lean, I think extra lean, ground beef on top. Now I'm gonna add just a tiny bit of ketchup, a tiny bit of mustard, and some cheese, and some pickles, and then we'll be done. One forty-nine. We're gonna go do school pickup, car pickup, Sienna theater pickup, dinner, get everything ready, do some laundry, and sweep the house. That's all we have left to do today. But I have to delete some scenes off of this SD card. But I thought I would just tell you what I'm doing. We're gonna get a school pickup, and I'm gonna go through this and clean it out, and then we will carry on with the rest of our day. Twenty-nine seconds. It is what? Uh, they're downstairs. I'll get them. It's 5.31. I have 
I put, so what I did is I put the vegetables that I showed you guys early on in the day in, I put them in a skillet first and then kind of sauteed them a little bit inside the juice from, and the meat inside this crock pot. I just put it all together. I put it on high. I also put the casserole that I made because I think I'm going to have some more of that in the oven. So that's heating up. I have dishes in front of me in the dishwasher that need to be put away and dishes in the sink that need to be put in there. I'm hoping to go to bed early tonight and I'm hoping to get this vlog up. Fingers crossed in like an hour. We have nothing really more to do today other than to eat dinner. So I think what I'm going to go ahead and do is end it. Get my butt into gear, get it on YouTube, and show you guys that I'm still alive. The five of you that watch my videos, I'm still here. I am hoping to get back into a routine. I think I said that the last time I vlogged, which was like a couple weeks ago. Uh, but in the meantime, though, we are preparing for the Bahamas, which is going to be really fun. I'm really excited to take you guys there with me. It is a vacation that I think you guys are going to really, really enjoy with me okay i am gonna eat dinner and i'll see you guys hopefully not as long as i have been taking a hiatus from you all all right bye